Hey Virgos, welcome and welcome back to the channel. Thank you guys so much for being here and showing all your love and support. I really do appreciate it. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already and make sure that your post notifications are turned on so you know every single time that I post. Let's go ahead and tap into these messages. If you're interested in your own personal reading, be sure to check the about section for my email. All right, let's pop into these readings. Virgo. Okay, so we got the lovers here. Somebody is definitely displaying some type of affection or love for you where you're doing this, or somebody's thinking about doing this. I don't know if this is coming off as a surprise to somebody, but there is someone that's in disbelief over a person's emotions. Okay, somebody's finally realizing who it is that they want to share some type of partnership with or create balance in their life with. I feel like this has been a long time coming. You could be dealing with a Gemini here. Somebody has a great amount of abundant love to give or show you. Somebody's really good at being affectionate or is into PDA here. Seven of Swords. You may have to watch somebody though. Okay, there's some sort of lie or trickery that someone is using love as a resource to get close to you. Okay, they're, they're using some type of like emotional tactic to find out what's going on in your life in your family or to obtain emotional stability okay somebody here could be after some type of um, wealth status assets and it seems like they had to act as if they were a loving dedicated partner towards you or this is you towards somebody i'm telling you whatever this love is it's gonna teach somebody a lesson here okay Somebody's going to feel burdened about their current intentions towards using love as a stipulation, okay? Somebody's going to end up oppressing or using uh, love as a tool only to become powerless, okay? Or somebody's only going to be able to get what they want at a certain level and then it die down. Okay, and at that point, they're going to have to apologize or realize that you were the past, whether you're masculine or feminine. Hmm. Yeah, somebody's disappointed in the way that you're taking something. There could be some sort of combativeness. Wow, this is going to be a recipe for disaster. Can we clarify the Seven of Swords here? Somebody could have a moon of Aquarius. Somebody's moon is Aquarius. Something could be happening within the next seven days, seven hours, seven weeks, seven months. Clarify the Seven of Swords. The Six of Cups. Somebody's going to try to remind you of the love that y'all have to make you forget about the seven of swords that they tried to send you, okay? Somebody definitely was looking into you before this point right here, and it looks like you're going to figure something out, or I'm hearing that there was a party where somebody will get drunk or try to get you drunk to obtain some type of victory for a change in a cycle, an unexpected event to occur where they would be the one on top of everything so that you would be in the Five of Cups. Somebody's trying to trick you into the Five of Cups energy. All in doing that by acting like they love you, they appreciate you, they admire you. <laughs> Somebody would be better off staying in hermit mode, okay? I 
actually, since we're talking about, um, well, let's see, message for Virgo. Somebody could be born 1967 or 1976, or something is depleted. Somebody is losing something. Somebody is losing insight or passion. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. Okay, we have separation. So there is a separation through the way that somebody touches you, makes you feel. There's some type of unrequited love, which is why you may have to separate from somebody. You're going to end up getting more information. And this is going to give you an analogy of, you know, you being too controlling or wanting to control the situation on how you want things to go. Let's see here. Wow. So we have dog close up. There is pleasure with a close friend. It looks like this close friend is this lover. At the bottom of the deck, we have broken wishbone. Wish will not be granted. So somebody that try to get close to you or use emotional tactics to um, get you to fall in love with them or trust them, you're going to have to trust your motives. Okay, look. Broken wishbone and un and not tells you the same thing. Wish will not be granted in unsuccessful plans. Okay. Somebody tried to get some type of like proof or something like that to to allow others to see you in a really different light. Okay. Somebody wanted you to be a part of a spiritual connection with them just so that they can uh, stab you in the back, lie to you, be cunning, okay? Somebody was looking for information and the only way to do that is to be your partner or significant other. a no strings attached type of relationship and they were willing to use some type of blackmail or secret against you that's just what it was only an intervention can help them or involuntary admission something that a person may have been hoping for or working on those are going to be canceled. Somebody's going to try to make plans just to cancel them, to stand you up. They want to see how far you will go to um, put all of your trust and faith. That will assure that everything else is going to work out smoothly. Yeah, this is somebody that's been studying your whereabouts, who you are, just to blackmail you. This is somebody with a vengeance. And they're using other minions for them. They could be um, convicts or they could have a criminal record. They're using those people to do their dirty work. <clears throat> Somebody is just slimy. Let's see. Holy Spirit Divine, show us the haters here. Show us the haters for Virgo. Okay, yeah, somebody is causing you to lose or miss out on an opportunity, stealing your ideas, pretending that they invented them. This has been showing up a lot for you guys. The person that's causing you negativity is a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. definitely some type of secrets or a information that's being hidden from you 
about a love connection or somebody that's in love with you. Somebody could be um, planning to get engaged or to have some type of higher level of commitment. But somebody's afraid that they have to hide something from you or ignore whatever gestures brings information or whatever this is. Yeah, somebody's trying to prevent you from digging up something or somebody's looking for dirt on you that they might have missed or ignored that you haven't told them. But somebody really don't have no life for real. They ain't shit. There's something about a female cousin. Okay. You're trying to figure out why she's dodging calls from you. It may have something to do with a false masculine. Or she could be dodging calls from a false masculine. Okay, so we have sweetheart, number 21. And we have illness. So somebody here could have, somebody's afraid of telling you that their child is sick or they're sick or some somebody's child is sick because of their parent, their babysitter, their school or whatever this is. Somebody was too stubborn enough not to follow some type of protocol and may have caused themselves to be ill or their family or something like that. This could be uh, from birth. Somebody here could have something going on with a pregnancy. Somebody could have just found out they were pregnant. This could be out of the blue. And they're realizing that they may not have, you know, done the right thing since they didn't know they were pregnant. So this could lead to um, a fetus being sick or having some type of like whatever this is can we clarify the sweetheart card somebody that's in a relationship could be finding out they're pregnant whether this is a planned pregnancy or not clarify the sweetheart card Wow, somebody here may be trying to cause you to have a abnormal pregnancy. This is somebody that hates you. Somebody is trying to arrange or prepare for um, a fortune or some sort of gift to come in. And they feel like they have to make sure they cover all their bases so that you will have a abnormal pregnancy. Somebody could be possibly playing with uh, dark magic. This is a bully here. This is somebody that that's, uh, has a spiritual gift that uses this to bully people spiritually. This is somebody that um, may be staying from home to home. This is somebody in your friend group. Could even be a family member what's the message somebody could be preventing you from getting pregnant or having a normal pregnancy okay so we have chemistry and influence and broken I'm telling you Something here when it comes to a connection or a relationship, I feel like you are being influenced to be attracted to someone or to attract a certain type of person or group of people just so that you'll be heartbroken at the end. message 
share for Virgo. Ooh. All right, so we have trapped soulmate and isolation. Somebody could be doing work on your person, whoever this, this individual is. They're a whole narcissist here. Somebody here is trapped from being around their soulmate by a narcissist. Somebody here could be using some sort of like higher influence to keep your person trapped away from you and liking them. Somebody that you may have thought burnt a bridge with you, you could be discussing something or you could have found out that somebody is being nosy or they're uh, talking about you, spreading rumors or whatever this is. Or this is you. Okay, so there's a masculine that's in his thoughts or something's crossing his mind at least. It could be something that is saddening or this could be a personal situation. It has something to do with um, a casino, gambling, money. Yeah, somebody could be sad about the money that they've gained or won or inherited, okay? Because it looks like it may have slowed down or stopped something, okay? I don't know, this doesn't make any sense to me. But I'm just reading the energy. Somebody, why would somebody be sad? Somebody is depressed. Even though they have a lot of money, they're depressed. Something has slowed down, stopped, or stagnated. And it has um, someone talking about a good gentleman here. Somebody could be um, mentally disturbed. Or doesn't understand the emotions that they come with or what they have. Message for Virgo. What is this that we need to know? Okay, so there's some type of bad influence when it comes to family or friends. This person could be secretly watching or knows of the person that they're trying to use with bad influence to come towards you, reject them. Okay. You're going to have to gain a new perspective to look at something differently when it comes to an air sign or somebody that has air in their chart, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I feel like you will find that you will be much happier or enjoy life when you tap into taking care of yourself. I'm hearing something about restoration. I don't know if somebody's going um, out to the pool, but I'm picking up on a noodle, one of those noodles that you can float with uh, in the water. It's like blue. Okay, there could be a pool party or association with a, a, a large crowd. Or somebody here could have like um, this, this nature to be around water to, to balance themselves out. There's something about a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, or someone with that sign in their chart. I heard somebody here is bad company. The people that you're getting mixed up with and think that you can create balance, there's some type of bad company or influence. Damn. What's the message here? Okay, so we have healing heart. You could be healing from heartbreak, freedom from toxic relationship or addiction. Okay, you've taken a chance or a risk to go away from uh, this codependency lifestyle, obsession, possession, or the blockages that you have. I do feel like Cupid is going to hit you with the arrow to fall in love again. Or for right now, you're healing. You could be healing from a water sign.
across the message. Okay, so there's a opportunity to earn something. Your financial situation could be changing or you might need to show proof of something. Or somebody has receipts on a person that may be receiving some type of government assistance, child support, or whatever this is. I feel like the person that you could be giving an offer to may be trying to pull at your heartstrings to gain information or something like that to compromise your life unexpectedly. There's some dirty deeds going on around here against you. It's insane. Somebody could be using your name to obtain something for themselves or to try to stagnate something from you or to whatever, okay? Yeah, somebody's emotions are in and out, coming and going. There's an earth sign that you really can't like pick up like why they would choose to go against you by being a karmic, okay? There is a third party or um, a person that may have learned a lesson from being in a relationship with a karmic that regrets being deceptive. I feel like somebody here is angry with the situation themselves because now they see that you are their true soulmate and they ruined it. They ruined it. What's the message here? Somebody's name could be Veronica. Or somebody's last name could be Vernon. V-E-R-N-O-N. Karma's catching up to somebody. Okay, for what they've done. There could be some type of property investment. Okay. I feel like there could have been a meeting. Or you could have uh, did business with somebody that you've... Um, came in, in passing with. Look, we have mental institution and we have turn off. Let's see, tell me more. What's the message for Virgo? Okay, so we have a Muslim. Somebody from the Muslim community could have married. They're married to the work or the money or their uh, career. We have nursing home. Somebody that may have a family member or a loved one in a nursing home could be facing challenging times because they feel like they're being programmed or controlled. Somebody here could be schizophrenic or have dementia or whatever this is. Oh man. So there could be communication issues or um, a non-existent connection between you and somebody, okay, that could be in the spotlight or have a big following or something like that. This person was paid to be an alibi or do favors or you may have paid somebody to do something and they turned on you, but you have a spirit, you have a superpower that allows you not to be affected by witchcraft or spell work here. You were supposed to be some type of industry sacrifice or you were supposed to take a hit for somebody's career to boom or jump off here and this is your own family or friend that is putting you through the ringer because they want fame or fortune that bad or uh, credibility recognition all right anyway 
Virgo, that's what I have here for your current messages. Hopefully it resonates. If it does, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, stay blessed. And I will see you guys in the next one.